Self-love is not narcissistic. It is not me, 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 like a baby who cannot see past the need for food or to drool or to poo. Self-love is not me first, like a toddler throwing tantrums. Self-love is an attitude. It is a way of perceiving the world from a place of deep happiness within you. Self-love means that you accept yourself what's and all and that you are squeezing every last drop from every day of your life. Some of you are wondering, so? So what? Why should I care? You should care because self-love is not innate. It is not inevitable. It is always, but always your choice. If you do not choose self-love, you will slowly die. And I cannot better the words of the poet Martha Maderos when she said, you die slowly. When you are unhappy at work, or do not follow a dream that keeps you awake. You die slowly when you pass your days complaining or do not find grace within yourself. You die slowly when you do not travel or do not read or do not listen to music. You die slowly when you do not remember that there is more to life than just breathing. When you choose self-love, every day is a day to celebrate being alive. Like it is a miracle a new day has dawned. You count the ways that you experience joy or the number of times you answer the question, why are you so happy? You marinate in the love when a friend tells you, thank you for being a big plus in my life. 